at that. What's up guys, it's your boy Dan, and today we have a gameplay video of Eleven Table Tennis. Now this table tennis game is already very popular amongst the VR community. It was available on sale for Black Friday this year, and I picked it up just to try it out. And oh my days, it is brutally, brutally realistic. And for someone who hasn't played table tennis much in the past, I've only played it a little bit in school, um, this is very difficult, a very difficult game. But for you table tennis veterans out there, you're gonna love this game because you can hit spin shots, you can do all your serving trick shots that you do in real life. Especially if you buy like a little attachment that goes onto the actual controller itself that makes it feel like a paddle. I think you're gonna absolutely love this game. So this is a short gameplay video. I'm gonna go through the single player, the mini games, and have a multiplayer match as well. I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you on the other side. Let's go. Here we are in 11 table tennis. Now, it's very minimalist uh, menu system that we have here. Um, well, if you have a problem, there's the email for the devs. And then we have this free hit. So I can turn this menu off and we've got this AI <laughs> trying to hit at me already. So you can just like little practice your skills, maybe while you're waiting for a multiplayer game. See if I can just, okay, yeah, I won that. I hit your paddle. Um, what else we have is we have a single player mode, um, a multiplayer mode, and mini games. And this is a little tutorial just to set it up. Now I'm going to start with the mini games first because it's an interesting one. We have different things to practice um, to play this game because this, this game is so realistic. You definitely need to jump into these practices. So we have a ball machine, quadrants, uh, beer pong, which I'll get to in a second, uh, free practice, service practice, and wall. And wall is awesome because it's just like what you're doing in normal table tennis. So you get the ball with um, with your left hand or your right, depending on what hand you are. Throw it up and hit against. Anyway, that's the wall. Um, let's jump into beer pong because I think this could be really cool to play multiplayer wise. Um, as you can see, it's actual beer pong. So I have the ball, I can throw it. Ooh. As you can see, as hard as it is in <laughs> real beer pong. Or you can bounce it as well. Do some trick shots from behind. <laughs> but this will be cool um, in multiplayer, to be honest. Obviously, for me right now, it's a bit sad just playing beer pong on my own. Um, but if you get one of those like uh, bottles that have a straw in them, fill it up with beer, and then you can drink it while you, you can still keep that headset on while you're drinking it. So that could be uh, really fun. All right, so let's jump into single player. Now, there's honestly, there's not much um, to this game at all. We have a single player mode here, and there's various difficulties, easy, medium, all the way to legendary. Now, I've played this game just before I turned the camera on, and I can tell you, hard, world-class, and legendary are very hard, world-class, and legendary. Like, they're hard um, modes. This is a proper um, table tennis simulator, so. I'm going to jump in medium just so you can see what happens. So we're going to start game. we got old Alfred over here. Um, we have a nice little space as well. We're in this apartment, which for some reason doesn't have a front door. Um, we have our TV, which has a score. Um, Alfred over there, a nice looking wardrobe. Behind us, our bed. Um, but as you can notice, as you can see, there's no door to this actual apartment. So we're locked here forever. <laughs> so very interesting okay so to play um, I grab the press the trigger button on my left controller I get the ball up and I can throw it up and I can serve so with this game you want a lot of space um, just because you're gonna be going left right um, this green screen behind me isn't big enough for this so you'll definitely see the walls of my room in this video um, but it's really realistic. Like if, if you gotta really practice for this game, um, it's, I find actually quite trouble with it at the moment. I've only just downloaded it um, earlier today. Uh, and <laughs> it's hard unless you already know how to play table tennis and you know all the different moves with the rackets and such. Um, it's definitely a difficult game to go in. It's not like a walkabout mini golf where you know everyone can put the ball and such. 
But this is like, this takes a lot of skill. It ain't no wee tennis, I can tell you that. Give a couple of shots here. I think I lost that one. Yeah, I lost that 11 1. Okay, stop talking here. Let's concentrate. Okay. So I know you can do like different spins on the ball as well. Um, top spin. If you know how to do that, then you are going to love this game. What would be nice, I think they actually do it um, a 3D printed handle uh, for the controller so you can actually feel like you're holding a racket. That would be pretty good. Okay, come on, let's try and win a couple games here. This Alfred's not bad. Oh man, okay, I'm getting destroyed. Yes, here we go, here we go. Come back, son, come back, son. Yep. Ooh, I tried something different there. The ball physics are fantastic as well. Um, I think I read about this game that the developers just wanted to make a really, really good uh, simulator, like a really realistic table tennis simulator. So they didn't think about, or didn't focus any of energies of doing like a nicer UI or um, pre-built like tournament modes. That would be cool if they had like tournament mode. Um, but I think they focus on gameplay more than anything, and it really shows. Like it's really accurate. And I must apologize for my table tennis skills because it is shocking. Okay, I'll have one more go and then we'll see if we can dive into some multiplayer and also get roasted. Have that. Okay, so I'm gonna end that game. So as you can see, that was on medium and I still got destroyed. So easy um, go for me going forward. And let's go into multiplayer. So with multiplayer here, we have just a lobby and it just it's just filtered in like proximity uh, the score that you can see here is just their rankings um, so if I could click on this one for example you see their current rank score their world rank and their ranked wing wins um, I can also just send them a challenge uh, so I can go down this list um, I can also see the leaderboard right now I see where I am um, nothing because I've not won one game <laughs> um, and see my profile uh, you can obviously search for different people. This game is actually going to be fantastic if you had a friend on Oculus as well. Um, but I'm just going to send a challenge to a few people. Alright, here we go. We have someone who wants an unranked match and they're wearing a mask. That's cool. <laughs> Bit creepy, but cool. Alright, here we go. Let's go. Yes. See, see the spin that they just see the spin that they're doing on the actual um, controller. Look at their serves. Like they know <laughs> they know how to play uh, table tennis. Because oh. he's spinning the ball, and I'm just like hitting it. Yeah. Like look at his spins. <laughs> I can't do much about that holy moly okay come on right whoa okay come on no that's my point come on yep oh man six five six six oh no that was a waste of a point seven seven what a game Come on. Yep. No, no. I don't know what it's up to. <laughs> oh, no. Yes. Oh, come on. That was my point. Yep. God damn it. Did he win? Oh, no. He's not won yet. Oh, no. Okay. He wins round one. And that's a wrap. I am so sorry about my table tennis skills. <laughs> that was awful on my part. But it is quite difficult to play a game with such realism um, and talking in front of the camera at the same time. So give me a little bit of props, you know? But yeah, I'm not that great at that game. But like I said, if you're into table tennis, 
you're going to absolutely love it. I hope you enjoyed that gameplay and if you want to see any gameplay for any other games on the Oculus Store, just leave a comment below and I'll be sure to try them out. Be sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos. I do an Oculus news show every single Friday at 9am Eastern called Let's Talk Oculus. So if you want to see that, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss an episode. That's all from me for today. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you on Friday. Hit them out. <laughs>